Learn from our experts anywhere, anytime with Deep Learn by ACE Engineering Academy. Hello, everyone. Welcome to ACE Engineering Academy. And let's continue our Atmanirbhar series. And today, as part of our series, what we're going to see is the Paralympic Games. Well, we all know we just con our Paralympic Games just got concluded. And let's look at India's performance at the Paralympic Games right from the inception of the Games. Here we go. The origin of the Games has uh, you know, been organized under the International Stoke Mandeville Games Federation, the first ever Paralympic Games, which was held in 1960 at Rome. And following on, uh, you know, it was actually previously open only to war veterans. So in 1948 and 1952, it was held, but it was open only to war veterans. Later on in 1960, it was held in Rome. So the first Paralympics, if you see in Rome, it saw a participation of 200 plus athletes from over 18 countries. But however, India did not participate in the 1960 and the 1964 events. Well, the word Paralympics, however, was approved by the International Olympics Committee in 1988 in Seoul, which is in South Korea which uh, was also when the event was held in the same city as the Olympics for the first time in 24 years. So basically, the Paralympics, the word Olympics for the Paralympics, actually for the first time was used in 1988. So you can see here the uh, official pin of the 1964, uh, you know, Tokyo uh, Paralympics there and the dove represents peace as well as love. So you can see the intersection of the rings there. So this was uh, the official pin for the Paralympics. Well, India's debut at Paralympics, India made their maiden appearance at Paralympics in 1968 in Tel Aviv, Israel. A total of 10 athletes were sent to the Games as part of the Indian delegation, which included men as well as women. There were two women. However, we did not have any medal at that point in time in 1968, but it was the first time that, you know, our para athletes uh, experienced uh, the Olympics. Well, having completed around 11 editions uh, until the last Paralympics, so we had won around uh, 12 medals from in the introduction of 1960, including four gold, four silver and four bronze. And Deepa Malik happened to be the only Indian woman on the list and all that has got changed this year. So as you can see here, the list of all the Olympians here, right from, uh, you know, the 1960, uh, wherein we have Murli Kant Petkar, then you, you, this is the whole list. And you can see of all the Paralympians who have won the medals. So we have Murli Kant Petkar who had won the gold, Bhim Rao Kesarkar who has won the silver, Joginder Singh Bedi bronze, Joginder Singh Bedi again he was in that same year he had won also a silver and again a bronze. So he's won the medal thrice if you see in the same year for different different games which was on javelin, on shot put as well as on discus throw. So all the athletics there. Then we have Devendra Jhajariya and Rajinder Singh Rahilu who had won the gold and the bronze. And there we have uh, Girish Gauda, Maria Pantangavelu, so we, Varun Singh Bhatti, Devendra Jhari again and Deepa Malik. So these were all our Paralympians who had actually won the medals until the last Olympics. You can have a look at the list of the Olympians here. So Murli Kant Petkar had won for swimming in the year 1972. So that's where our medals, we started to win our medals. There we go, Murlipa, Murlikant Petkar. So he's a war veteran uh, who went on to become India's first Paralympic gold medalist. Murlikant Petkar, there we have. He was also called as Janbaz Jal Sipahi. And he had won uh, the medal in Germany Paralympics in the swimming event, uh, wherein... Uh, 
In fact, he was the war veteran who lost his arm in the Indo-Pakistan War in 1965. So that's Murlikant Petkar from Maharashtra. So there we see Rahul Dravid uh, felicitating uh, Murlikant Petkar. You can see one of his picture where he doesn't have an arm. There you can see. So he was a soldier of the Indian Army and the first individual gold medalist of the Paralympics for India. So they have launched a book called Courage Beyond Compare in Mumbai. So that's about uh, Murli Kant Petkar. Uh, then we have Devendra Jhajharia who had won in the men's javelin throw. And uh, then we have the silver medalists Bhim Rao Kesarkar, uh, Joginder Singh Bedi and Girishan Gauda and Deepa Malik. So these are our silver medalists who have won at various uh, Olympics. You can have a look at them. In fact, Bhim Rao Kesar, uh, Kesarkar had won in the men's javelin throw, Joginder Singh in shot putt. Girishan Gauda I was, you know, he was the only one who had won the medal in 2012 uh, Olympics. He was a high jumper. And then Deepa Malik, the first and the only Indian woman until now to win the Paralympics medal. Uh, she had won it in shot put. In fact, Deepa Malik has a lot of achievements and she heads the Paralympic uh, committee in India right now. So there we have the silver medalists. Look at them. Devendra Jhajariya, there is Maria Panthangavelu, Deepa Malik uh, and Varun Singh Bhati along with Sachin Tendulkar. So they are there with their medals. Learn from our experts anywhere, anytime with Deep Learn by ACE Engineering Academy. So some pictures of them. Uh, how inspirational they are, the Paralympians and so much uh, we can learn from them that, you know, disability is not uh, a curse, you know, if it's, it's all about the mental strength. So there we have the bronze medalists, Joginder Singh Bedi and Rajinder Singh Rahelu and Varun Singh Bhati. So, Joe Ginder Singh again in javelin's throw, then uh, we have, uh, in, he also won again in the discus throw and uh, Rajinder Singh had won uh, in powerlifting and uh, Varun Singh Bhati again won uh, there. So, you can see the bronze medalists. So, those are the pictures there, Rajinder Singh Rahilu and Joe, Joe Ginder Singh Bedi. Let's now look at the Tokyo 2020 Paralympic Games. Well, don't miss out on the inspiration from the Paralympics. Let's look at India's brilliant performance this year. Well, this is the Paralympics symbol and the mascot, as you can see here. So Metis is the mascot and this is the symbol, the green, blue and red uh, agitos. Agitos in Latin means put in motion and keep going. I think that's what the Paralympians have taught us. Just keep going, right? It is expressing the Paralympians who continue to take on challenges even in the face of difficulties. So that's the Paralympic symbol and the mascot. So the Tokyo 2020 Olympics uh, was held from 24 August to the 5th of September and uh, Let's look at their performances and what are the medals they have won. Well, India, we have won around 19 medals and this is supposed to be the best Paralympics ever we had till now. So five gold, eight silver and six bronze medals. And this is the medals list and our winners here. So let's start off with uh, Bhav. Bhavina Patel, who had won uh, in table tennis. In fact, the first time we have won in table tennis, she's won a silver. Nishad Kumar has won for high jump, a silver. Avni Lekhera. Now, Avni Lekhera becomes the first woman to win two medals at the Olympics uh, this year. And in fact, after Deepa Malik, she's the woman who has won it. So this time we have uh, women who have won it uh, after Deepa Malik. 
So Avni Lekhera has won the gold in uh, 10 meters air rifle shooting. Devendra Jhajaria has won the silver in the men's javelin throw. So, Sundar Singh Gurjar has also won a bronze in the men's javelin throw. Yogesh Katunia has won the silver in the men's discus throw. So javelin, discus, all these things come under athletics. Uh, Sumit Antle has won the gold in the javelin throw. Uh, Singraj Adhana has won the bronze in, again, uh, air pistol shooting. Maria Pantangavelu has won the silver in the men's high jump. Sharad Kumar has won the bronze for men's high jump. Praveen Kumar has won silver in the men's high jump. Avani Lekhera, again, we see that she has won the bronze in the uh, 50 meters rifle uh, positions. So she's won tw twice. So one in the 10 meter rifle and the other in the 50 meter rifle. And so she's won the gold and the bronze, which makes her uh, the only woman Paralympian to win two medals. Harvinder Singh has won the bronze uh, in archery. Manish Narwal has won it again for pistol uh, shooting. Then Singh Ranj Adhana has won for again uh, pistol shooting. Pramod Bhagat has won for badminton. So this is the first time we see that uh, we have a medal. Uh, we have a medal. I mean, we have opened our account in uh, Paralympics badminton. So and he's won straight. His debut is a straight gold. Manoj Sarkar has won the bronze in again badminton. Suhas Yathiraj has won the silver for men's singles badminton and Krishna Nagar has won the gold for badminton. So we see that, uh, you know, a brilliant show put up by the Indian Paralympic contingent. That's, that's, you can see all of them there, all the winners of our uh, Team India. So there we have all of them. Well, with this, we conclude the episodes, the three parts of the Olympics that uh, is under the Atmanirbhar series. Do to tune into our YouTube videos for more such episodes on the various current events that are happening across India and the world. So please tune into our channel and subscribe to our channel. And mind you, the only disability in life is a bad attitude, said by Scott Hamilton. So uh, I wish you all the very best for all your preparation. Stay motivated and please do subscribe to our courses on our Deep Learn channel from the Ace Engineering Academy. You can also reach out to me on my uh, email ID that is neelima.faculty at gmail.com for any of your queries and doubts. You can also subscribe to my Telegram channel, which is Current Issues with Neelima. See you again with another exciting episode from the Atmanirbhar series. I'm Neelima here. Thank you very much. Learn from our experts anywhere, anytime with Deep Learn by ACE Engineering Academy.